Good morning, my peoples. <laughs> I'm happy, happy, happy to report to you this morning. I have gotten my MRI out of the way Friday. And we're heading to the orthopedic surgeon to find out the results of that MRI to see what kind of damage I have in that right foot, if any, and to what extent. But we're looking toward the next step whatever it may be, braces, surgery, whatever we've got to do, I've got to be fixed. I've got to move on with life. I'm at a stalemate. You know, if you're used to being out on the trap line or out hiking or kayaking or just being out in nature and you can't be mobile, it's hard on the mind, I'm telling you. It'll break your will. It'll destroy your morale and your confidence. Being behind those walls will absolutely drive you nuts. Uh, it's gotten to the point where I can stand probably 40 minutes, and then I have to find me a seat somewhere to get off this foot. Now I'm talking about working at the lathe. The hike I took the other day, to the, the solo hike I took to the cabin, I paid for it for about three days. But I was willing to sacrifice to get out behind them walls but I'm going to take you with me this morning they won't let me video anyone inside the hospital so I'll take you up to the door and I may make a snippet video in the exam room as we wait on the doctor and then I will update you as I leave I'm going to attempt to get him to run me off a paper image of the MRI maybe will maybe won't but nevertheless, I want to say I appreciate you and your support uh, for the MBA ch uh, channel. It's a morale builder. It's a confidence builder. And I don't take your friendship for granted. Not one iota. Not nary a bit do I take your friendship and your support for granted. So let's get this done. We're almost here, Middlesboro, Kentucky. We're gonna head in and see what they have to say. <laughs> so stick around, stay with me. Catch you in a minute. So we've made it to the exam room. I'm now waiting on the doctor to come in. Uh, so he can tell me the results of the MRI. Uh, I'm going to try to attempt to get him to run me off a paper image copy of the MRI and try to show that as well. But uh, nevertheless, I'm excited. Uh, just another piece of the puzzle. It's been a good day. Stick around. I'll update you when I leave here. Get out of here. We go out this way. So, uh, two options. <laughs> uh, Ken is tore severely. Don't even know if there's enough there to even repair without reconstructive surgery. Doing a wrap, breaking the bone. Adding tendon, going up through the top of the foot, and securing the ankle pin for a brace, I guess. Or we can go with an orthotic brace that goes on the inside of the shoe. So what do you do? Maybe enough there to repair, maybe not. Is it worth the risk? Maybe so, maybe not. But, uh, I'm going to meet with a guy to put my foot in a mold to uh, try and insert for six to eight weeks. Then from there, if that doesn't work, reconstructive surgery. So six to eight weeks, possibly a waste, maybe not. I have to wear it for the rest of my life. 
either or then reconstructive surgery if it doesn't work so uh do you suffer it out and uh, burn uh, eight weeks as a trial to uh, see if you can avoid surgery <laughs> or do you have the surgery and uh, burn in the summer you know what I'm saying I'm upset I'm tore up really I am this is not a crying complain whine bitching video excuse my words for a lack of a better term but <laughs> I burnt far too much time with this so we're going to go with the insert I'm going to burn six to eight weeks have to work the rest of my life he said look like a wad of broken rubber bands inside my foot. Is there enough rubber bands to put back together to assure that I have uh, my arch back and be repaired? We don't know. Get in there and it may not be worth... You get in there and you may have to do a wrap down through the top of the foot and an anchor at the ankle. My Achilles tendon is good. So it's on with an insert. Burn eight weeks, hoping that it'll work. Hoping that it solves the problem. I'll, I'll wear it the rest of my days. <laughs> the rest of my life. And I could go in for a, a wrap down through the top of the foot. They drill through the top of the foot. They then pull the tendon back up. Wrap it in, and anchor it at the ankle. Breaking the bones, complete re reconstructive surgery on the foot. So it is what it is. It's either the insert or reconstructive surgery. I'm going with the insert, and I'm going to suck it up buttercup and push through it. Uh, I asked him about hiking, kayaking, camping. The insert could possibly work. I'll know in six to eight weeks. So that's the update. Kind of aggravated, kind of upset. Kind of tore up because I don't want to burn any more time at a standstill. So that's your update. I've got the MRI image in the report. I may upload it, may not. May go home, look at it, may not. May throw it in the garbage, may not. I don't know. <laughs> Thanks for watching. That's your update for today. Insert or reconstructive surgery. I'm going to go. With first things first, I'm going with the insert. I'm going to burn six to eight weeks wearing an insert in my shoe. A low profile brace that's molded to my foot. For my foot. If that doesn't work six to eight weeks, then it's on to Lexington for reconstructive surgery. And the healing time on that is a cast in months. So it is what it is. I guess it's kayaking and fishing. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I'm tore up. Anyway, this is Ron Smith, Mount Bush Crafters Lines. I love you all. You know what I do. Sorry about the drama and the crying and complaining, but it is what it is. Go farther, stay longer. I'll catch you out in the field. Let's go home.